doing each day? Yeah, well, you, we really all have three roles. We've got uh, uh, our political voice and educating other people about why we care about this, uh, hopefully on a bipartisan way. Uh, we've got our dollars as consumers, so buying an electric car, even though it, it still has a, a bit of a trade-off, uh, contributes to the cause. You know, likewise, the, these new types of uh, meat production products and all the products you buy, you'll have green ratings over time and we'll get the quality of those to be so you can direct your dollars according to your, your beliefs. Finally, you know, wherever you work, uh, they can make a contribution, whether it's their buying power, their skill set. You know, we see the finance sector, the tech sector all coming in and saying things like, okay, we can afford to buy green steel and cement, and so let's uh, we'll help get that market going. And we can make our data center so it's not just sort of green, but it really never takes any uh, hydrocarbon uh, generation to, to help power that data center. And so, you know, as companies, it's great that they're kind of competing to say, okay, we care about this cause uh, because we're a good citizen, because our employees want us to, uh, you know, that that can help get even the hard parts of the problem uh, on that learning curve. Thanks, Bill, and thanks for the book, How to Avoid a Climate Disaster. Thanks for being with us. Yeah, great to talk to you.